spell of that. The lady is fantastic. Hand delivered. Swank. I wasn't sure you'd come. It's nice of you to see me. Don't say that. Do you hate me, Therese? Oh, how could I hate you? Abby tells me you're thriving. You've no idea how pleased I am for you. And you look very fine, you know? So you've suddenly blossomed. Is that what comes of getting away from me? No. What? Nothing. Harge and I are selling the house. I've taken an apartment on Madison oh, Avenue. And a job, believe it or not. I'm going to work at a furniture house on 4th Avenue as a buyer. Have you seen Rindy? Once or twice. She's living with Harge for now. The right thing. Anyway, the apartment's a nice big one, big enough for two. I was hoping you might like to come live with me, but I guess you won't. Would you? meeting some people at the Oak Room at 9, if you want to have dinner. If you change your mind, I, I think you'd like them. Therese, is that you? <laughs> what do you know? I I'm saying to myself, I know that girl. Jack. Gee, it's great to see you, Therese. It's been months. Months. Yeah. Jack, this is Carol Aird. Pleased to meet you. Likewise. Well, uh, hey, uh, Ted Gray's meeting me here, and a bunch of us are heading down to Phil's party. You going, aren't you? Yes, I just planned to get there. You two go ahead. Are you coming along? No. No. I have to make a few calls before dinner anyway. I really shouldn't know. Are you sure? Of course. Well, it would be great to catch a ride. Yeah, sure. You two have a wonderful night. Nice meeting you, Jack. Nice meeting you. All right, well, uh... Let me go make sure the loaf's on his way. Back in flash. <laughs> 